Hey, the Maryland Terps basketball team looking to start another win streak. The Terps looked, uh, they took off for Wisconsin tonight where they're going to battle the Badgers tomorrow. WMAR 2 News' Sean Stepner caught up with the Terps today in College Park. It's time for the Terps to pack their bags and get back to life on the road. The team's going to be really, really good and uh, the atmosphere is going to be really crazy, so it's got to be ready. We got a lot of tough teams on this, this next stretch of games is going to be tough. Maryland plays four of its next five games away from Xfinity Center. What's hard is we're coming off three out of four on the road. Now we got four of our next five on the road, so I don't know who does that to a team. Arguably the best, maybe the toughest stretch. Over the next four games, the number 21 Terps play three ranked teams starting Friday when they visit number 24 Wisconsin. The Badgers haven't lost since a four point defeat in College Park back on the 14th. In that contest, they overcame a 21 point deficit before succumbing to Maryland. I'm really proud of that one. That's probably our best win to be quite honest with you. We just can't let them get hot again. Maryland heads to Wisco after getting right ending a two-game skid by routing Northwestern 70-52 to here at Xfinity Center on Tuesday night. It was a game that proved the Terrapins can do it without relying so much on Anthony Cowan, the motor that makes Maryland run only playing 19 minutes after running into foul trouble. We got a really good group of players. I mean, they got a lot to do with our success, um, so they just got to stay confident. And it's my job to keep them calm. It just proves that when in crunch time, even in bad situations like not having Al and not having Bruno, we can still maintain. We've become a deeper team. Um, guys are ready to step up when they have to, but that um, yeah, was good to see. Friday's game in Madison tips off at 9 p.m. In College Park, Sean Stepner, WMAR 2 News.